Two people are dead after a crash in Champaign County. And the sheriff's office there just releasing new details on both the victims and what led to that crash between a van and a semi on Route 235 today. News reporter Dana Smith takes a look at the crash report in this now developing story. Mark, it happened right here next to me at this intersection. You're looking at, this is Old Troy Pike right here, and this is Ohio 235, and it's pretty calm out here right now, but it was quite the different scene earlier today. Police say the victims were riding in a van, and they ran that stop sign right there and collided with a semi. The front of this van destroyed. The two people riding in it, a man and a woman, dead. The Champaign County Sheriff's Office has identified the victims as 36-year-old Andrew G. and 38-year-old Rochelle Carr, both of Troy. Neither was wearing a seatbelt. Christiansburg Fire Captain Dan Welty said the semi was heading south on Ohio 235. The van was heading west on Old Troy Pike and failed to stop at the intersection. The man and the woman inside the van were thrown from the vehicle after the impact and the semi dragged the van a few feet down the road before it came to a stop. Just momentum, driving 55 mile an hour, a semi like that probably weighs 40,000 pounds, you just don't stop on a dime. Force of the impact kind of pushed his trailer off the road, so it took that long for him to be able to recover from the accident. The Christianburg Fire Department and the Champaign County Sheriff's Office responded to the scene, and all roads leading to this intersection were closed for hours today as officials investigated the scene. Neighbors who live in the area say today's accident was a familiar scene. Around five years ago, at this same intersection, a woman died after her car collided with a semi. I think it's people just not paying attention and run that stop sign or whatever. I think that's what's going on. The lady got killed a few years ago, that's what happened. She pulled up and stopped and then just pulled right out in front of the semi. So. The driver of the semi was taken to a local hospital for non-life-threatening injuries. In Champaign County, Dana Smith, 2 News, working for you.